Okay, so in this lesson, I'm going to anchor his legs and arms to the body. To the body. Okay, let's start by selecting not the arms. These layers are not going to be used. The ones that control them are the ones that interest me. So I'm going to use the shoulder, both shoulders and both hips. For that, I'm going to maximize the timeline. I'm going to unlock them first. Hip, that's the right hip, that's the left hip, that's the right shoulder, and the left shoulder. There you go. Now, take every single one of them. The left shoulder, right shoulder, left hip, right hip. Now, take the pick whip of any of those. I'm going to take this pick whip and click and drag to the body. There you go, here. Tick. And now, as you can see, in here, its parent is body. And that happened to all of them, you see? Now, without deselecting them, I'm going to lock all of them. So if I select the body here in the timeline, let's select the body here. Yeah. Hey, my pockets. And not only that, can you see the mats are there too, <laughs> are staying. So if you can see this area, something's not working. Okay, so let's go ahead and anchor the pockets and the mats. Let's select all the mats, mat, mat, mat. Okay, and do the same. Pick whip and click and drag to body. There it is, body. Okay, now the pockets. Where are the pockets? Pockets, there they are. There you go. And I'm going to do something else, the neck it's going to be parented to the body also. Very good. And the face is going to be left alone because we're going to work on that on the next tutorial. We're going to do an effect in which we're going to give the impression that we're using 3D, making his head turn to one side or the other. Super amazing effect. So let's test the body. Body. Maximize this part. Yeah. Ah, I don't have a body. Hey, look this cool magic trick. Ah. Whoa. Oh, that's a weakness. Look. You see? <laughs> okay, just... I don't think we're gonna be doing that. <laughs> but yeah, everything else is according to plan. Okay, let's leave it like this. I'm gonna drop the body right there. And let's do something else. I'm going to lock everything, every single part that I am not using, I'm going to lock it here. Let's tidy up this workspace, okay? I'm going to take these arms and I'm going to hit lock. Hey, no, sorry. Lock. Now, the leg, all of these guys are going to be locked. Actually, from all the way from here, all the way to below neck. All this area is going to be locked. Good. And that's about it. Look. Oh, also the hair. Oh no, the hair is going to be left alone. Leave it. Now if I want to select any part, I, I can only select the body and the controllers. Yes. If I want to select anything else, it's not going to allow me. So that gives me five things to work on in the body. 
the controllers for the two arms, the two legs and the body. Perfect. And I'm going to hide these little points that I don't need anymore. How do you hide them? Well, by clicking on their eyes. If you click and drag, you hide them all in a row. Look. Now I'm only leaving the controllers. You see? Okay, let's do this. In the next tutorial, nah, I'm going to work on his face, his head. There you go. Hey, long arms. Pretty long arms you got there. See you in the next tutorial.